654 right now. Let's take a look at some of the stories that we're following as you head out the door. We start this morning with Way 31's Rodnia Ross. Tonight, the Madison County Board of Education will meet to discuss school safety. The Madison County Sheriff Kevin Turner is expected to be at the meeting where school resource officers and overall safety will be the topics of conversation. The board will also discuss a demographic study they requested. The study will help them determine where the district is growing and which schools are becoming at or near capacity. The results from the study will be released at the meeting. The meeting will be at 515 at the district's central office. Casey? Today, Decatur City Schools will be holding their State of the Schools address. We know the superintendent will be discussing building changes, workforce developments, and testing. And right before that, there's a special session being held by the Board of Education. And it all, it all begins this morning at 7. Marie. Mountain Nature Preserve warned hikers not to walk alone after someone was sexually assaulted on one of the trails there. Right now, there's no description of the attacker. As we learn more information, we will pass it along to you both on air and online. Pat. The DeKalb Jackson Water Supply District says it's looking for a new manager as it tries to fix the dangerous chemicals found in the water. At a meeting yesterday, the community asked the board how it plans to fix the issue if they aren't organized. Well, the department says this is not an emergency, and officials routinely monitor for the presence of drinking water contaminants. Marie? A local group will be placing wreaths on the graves of veterans today. They will be at the Valhalla Cemetery on Winchester Road. The local chapter of Wreaths for Veterans organized the effort and have done so since 2007. Organizers got the idea from seeing similar wreaths at Arlington National Cemetery. Huntsville was the first city in Alabama to start the tradition, and it now happens statewide. Rob?